Mr. Wilson, you appeared on the front page of the Houston Post pictured with LBJ at the opening of the Astrodome in 1965. Yes, I was close to both Hoff Hines and Bob Smith. At the time, Bob Smith owned uh, two-thirds of the Astros and Judge Roy Hoff Hines owned one-third. Then there were some minor ownerships. Uh, George Kirksey owned one percent, and, uh, and Craig Cullinan, I think, owned one percent. But anyway, the, uh, <clears throat> uh, the both were friends of mine. So when uh, the Astrodome opened on J July, no, not July, but on April the 9th, nineteen sixty-five. Uh, the Houston Post, a daily newspaper in Houston, owned by the Hobby family. By the way, this morning I had lunch with Bill Hobby, the son of the founder of the Houston Post. Uh, his father was governor of Texas, William P. Hobby. Hobby Airport in Houston is named after his father. Anyway, uh, so, <clears throat> When the Astrodome opened, we played the New York Yankees and beat them, by the way. I often wonder if that game was thrown by them since they were not in our league. <coughs> uh, and uh, Mickey Mantle hit a home run that day. It was an exciting time. So President Johnson, who was president at the time, had been invited to attend with his wife, Lady Bird. And so he, he accepted and they flew in from the LBJ ranch where they were spending the weekend to uh, the game. So after, uh, uh, <clears throat> I was invited to be part of, to enjoy the game from Hoffheim's suite. So, uh, I was in the suite along with Johnny Goen, Welcome Junior's godfather, and Archie Bennett, who was uh, married to my sister. So, uh, and the Houston Post had sent a photographer to the other side of the Astrodome with a telescopic lens to take a photograph of Hoffheim's box. So the next morning, on the front page of the Houston Post, there's a photograph of LBJ and Lady Bird and Judge Roy Hoffines, along with me and Johnny Goen and Archie Bennett and a Secret Service agent on the front page of the Houston Post. <clears throat> 